What's up, you too? Man, you know what I'm saying? It's your boy Jay back with another video. James Hardy just got traded to the Brooklyn Nets. Craziest trade, man, about five years. Yeah, man, this is a crazy trade. Uh, one of the craziest trades has been in a while, in a long, long time, and it's really one of the biggest game-changing trades there has ever been. Uh, James Harden was traded to the uh, Brooklyn Nets from the Houston Rockets in exchange for Karis LeVert, who was headed to the Indiana Pacers, and Victor Oladipo, who was headed to the Houston Rockets. Yes, it was a three-way trade between the Pacers, Nets, and Brooklyn. No, Pacers, Nets, and the Rockets. Now, they still don't know where Kyrie Irving is. You know, he's been off the grid, hiding from the NBA and the Brooklyn Nets, kind of throwing Kevin Durant under the bus because he was at a party with no mask and he was under investigation now. You know, he doesn't really like to deal with all the media and stuff, so he's just hiding, avoiding whatever penalties and whatever uh, fee or fine they had to pay. So I guess he's just trying to dodge that. He's trying to do the race, I guess you could say. Even though it's really not that serious, he has the money to pay for it. I'm not going to, but we're not going to get into that this time. But, uh, yeah, James Harden on the Brooklyn Nets, man, that's going to be crazy. Kevin Durant, James Harden haven't played together since he was on the Thunder and was rookie of the year. Not rookie of the year, sixth man of the year. And now that they're both the best scorers in the NBA, I don't know how that's going to work, especially adding a guy like Kyrie Irving who couldn't play with LeBron James. One of the, the best uh, facilitators of all time. You're going to play with other ball hogs? Kevin Durant's not a ball hog. Kevin Durant's good. He can play off ball, but James Harden, there's no way in the world. Y'all were talking about Russell Westbrook. Kyrie Irving holds the ball just as much. More, in my opinion. Uh, yeah, man, the Nets, it might be a good team on paper, but, but just teamwork-wise and chemistry, I think it's going to be terrible. Just think about it, bro. He got so mad. He, Emotions got in the way in Houston. Kyrie Irving's emotions. Kevin Durant, he's getting better with his emotions. But, man, those guys are not showing that they can just play basketball. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, it's looking good on paper, but will it be good? Now, I like Kevin Durant. I'm a James Harden fan, too. If they can be good, I want them to be good. But will they be good? We don't know. We're going to have to wait and see. Uh, we're going to pray for the best for them, honestly. We're going to hope Kyrie comes back, stop acting crazy. He wants to just be an NBA player because that's what his job is and what he gets paid to do. He wants to deal with media and all that stuff so people can get their money. Nobody's trying to exploit you nothing. They just trying to, everybody's just trying to get money. So why don't you allow people to do their jobs? And is it really bothering you? No. So come on. It's all I, yeah, man. This has been a drop. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. Give me your comments down below what you think the Nets going to be like. What the situation in Houston is going to be like. And do either team have a chance at the NBA Finals? I think the Nets do. The Rockets, man. They'll go to the playoffs. But yeah, like, comment, subscribe. Give me some video ideas down below. It's Zahi. And I'm out.